Good morning, Kind of Pirates. I'm Rai. I'm Anaya. And today we have a packed show for you with all the latest updates around town. So stay tuned because it's all right here, right now, on Pirate TV. TV. That's right, we're kicking things off with a special recognition. It's Assistant Principals Week here in Crandall, and we want to take a moment to appreciate all the hard work and dedication our assistant principals put into our schools. Absolutely, they play such a crucial role in shaping the educational experience for our students. Let's give them a round of applause. All right, so something that most people don't know about me is I do have a degree in criminal justice. And so I really enjoyed that and uh, it was something that was a lot, lot of fun. However, I found a different avenue to where I got, got into teaching. So it's uh, definitely, definitely a whole enjoyable thing. You want me to go first? Yes. You want to go first? <laughs> you go first. Um, so I actually am the first person in my family to graduate high school and to go to college and to get a degree. Oh, oh and personally, personal wise, um, I have a huge Donald Duck collection. Oh, yeah. um, I like to travel with my family, and a part of that is taking my daughter to all the zoos possible. Um, and then what I love about the high school, man, it's, it's all the people uh, from our students, our parents, uh, our teachers, uh, custodial staff, paras, uh, and admin team. Man, it's such a great place to be. And man, it makes it, makes it a joy to work here. So man, I love Crandall ISD, love Crandall High School. Go Pirates. My favorite part is working with our diverse community and seeing small town Crandall grow and do bigger things. And me, it's just watching everybody walk the stage at graduation. other news, April is Autism Acceptance Month, and our community is coming together to show support and raise awareness. From fundraisers to awareness campaigns, there are plenty of opportunities to get involved and make a difference. Stay tuned for more details on how you can participate. On Tuesday, April 2nd, many students were wearing blue in support of World Autism Awareness Day, which is fantastic. But something else this year's month of April is the National Autism Acceptance Month, so support doesn't just last for that day. Now, some can be asking, well, what's the difference between awareness and acceptance? Aren't they basically the same thing? Then that would be false. <clears throat> Being aware is just simply knowing that it exists. Accepting something is taking it as a fact, and knowing you can to allow for it to become more prevalent in your world. Celebrating, donating, and volunteering for organizations to help people with autism during this month is really recommended, as it helps to destigmatize any harmful stereotypes that are still used to describe autistic people. Some great resources for this <clears throat> Autism Acceptance Month are the Autism Society, the American Autism Association, <clears throat> Autism Speaks, and while we still have access to it, TikTok, because nothing is more better than learning about real-life situations. And remember, the most important part of this month is to embrace all flaws and strengths of one another. <clears throat> As a way to... Is <laughs> I remember the most important part of this month is to embrace all flaws and strengths of people with autism display as a way to help those feel more comfortable in our society and learning environments. So take the chance, learn something more about it, get educated, talk to people. Reporting for Pirate TV, I'm Rai, and now back to the studio. Next up, we have something for all you anime enthusiasts out there. The Anime Club at Crandall High School is hosting their annual Anime Expo this weekend. Get ready for a cosplay contest, screenings of your favorite anime, and much more. We'll have all the details on how you can join in on the fun. I'm Anthony Minifi from Prior TV, and I'm here to talk about Anime Club. The Anime Club is where you get to read mangas, you get to play games, and you get to watch your favorite animes. The Anime Club starts on Thursdays after school from 3 to 4 p.m. or on Fridays during navigation. I have got Mr. Adams to talk about the Anime Club and some of his students. What's up guys, Mr. A. Today I'm talking about Anime Club. We've been going strong for about a good eight months. Um, my favorite anime has to be Attack on Titan, as y'all already know what it's about. So, 
Uh, Anime Club is going awesome. We have a lot of cool stuff to do. And I would love it if y'all would stop on by and just hang out with us. I like Anime Club a lot. It's actually really fun. And I get chances to read manga that I've never read before. It's also uh, interesting because I get to make new friends every day and just chill with them. It's very relaxing. Okay, I joined the anime club. Like, low key, I don't like anime, but like, I joined because, I mean, I really, it was something to do. And I got to join with my friend. And like, you know, there's people in there. And I mean, they're cool, they're nice. Why'd you join the anime club? <clears throat> I joined because, unlike her, I actually do like anime, and I love reading, so this is like kind of nice, and I got to meet some new people, and it's chill, so. Yeah. Spring has sprung, and that means it's time for some spring cleaning. The city of Crandall is gearing up for its annual spring cleanup event. Whether you want to volunteer or just learn more about how you can keep our city beautiful, we'll have everything you, you need to know. The city of Crandall invites all residents within the Crandall city limits to help out clean and donate supplies for our city on Saturday, April 13th from 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. in 104 E Trunk Street. Some acceptable items to donate can include furniture, mattresses, box springs, appliances, and many more. Some not acceptable items include tires, paint, and electronics. Check the City of Crandall socials or the main website for more information and details. Attention all students! The Student Council has some exciting events planned for this upcoming month and you won't want to miss out. From charity drives to school spirit days, there's something for everyone. Stay tuned for a rundown of all events on the horizon. Crandall High School and Student Council presents Pirates Got Talent auditions Tuesday, April 23rd and Wednesday, April 24th after school starting at 3.30 p.m. Must provide your own materials, instruments, anything that's talent related. Sign up for your time slot and scan that QR code below. Auditions, remember, is after school, April 23rd and 4th at the high school. Crandall High School Pirates Got Talent take place Thursday, May 9th after school, benefiting the local animal shelters, collecting blankets, dog toys, cat toys to donate to animal shelters in our community. Entry is free. This will take place 6 through 8 p.m. Now, it's time to shine the spotlight on some of our outstanding students. Our own Nicholas Drake will be highlighting some students who have been making waves both in and out of the classroom. From academic achievements to extracurricular involvement, these students show what it is to be hardworking and dedicated. Don't miss out on the exclusive student spotlight coming up next. Hi, I'm Detrick and this is Trevor. I'm the guitarist and he's the drummer for our band Strider. Um, our band is basically alternative rock. We have some indie in our stuff and it sounds pretty similar to Pearl Jam, Stone Temple Pilots, if that's your thing, then give us a listen. Me and Alex have been doing this band together for a while, like since seventh grade in middle school. I first wanted to pick up guitar but then decided to do drums and then he picked up the guitar and we kind of just ran as a duo for a while and then we picked up some other band members and we've just been doing music since since middle school, yeah. Any updates, any album releases, singles, EPs, um, you name it, uh, we're going to be doing 